all the latest on the Saw Guy podcast, be sure to subscribe and don't forget that bell icon. Welcome to the Saw Guy podcast. As always, y'all know, I am the Saw Guy, and you're joining me for five dollar horror finds, right? <laughs> As I said, this is my favorite time of the year because this is where you find all of the just most random horror films out there for five bucks, maybe even less, because I've been lucky enough to find some that are like three seventy-five, four bucks, and so forth, right? But anyways, I'm digging through, and I've been a fan of this series for a long time from the video games and everything, but I found this one right here, Resident Evil. They say it's the final chapter. This is actually the last one out of the whole series. I personally don't believe that it is the final chapter. <laughs> I mean, they said that with part three, then they said Afterlife and all the other poems of the series, but you know what? Final chapter wasn't that bad. I saw it in theaters and I really liked it. I mean, compared to the previous one that they did, um, my favorites out of the whole series are obviously, you know, the first two right off the bat. I love Afterlife and then it comes into this one. And this one was really cool because I mean, the way that they ended the story was just like, whoa, okay, that's pretty cool how they did that. But, I mean, is it really the final chapter of the Resident Evil series? Who knows, right? Maybe the T-Virus is going to break out again. <laughs> and, you know, with all the talk about the uh, Resident Evil 2 video game remake, and now they're possibly thinking about doing Part 3 as a remake, I mean, who knows? I mean, maybe they might continue this story. We'll see, right? <laughs> but thank you all for tuning in for $5 Horror Finds, and I'll catch you all next time, as always. Bow down to the... Bow down to the cave